everyone. Welcome to our channel. Rebecca Stu and the crew. I'm Rebecca and today is Friday. So that means it's time for our weekly what's new this week at the Dollar Tree video. And it will be for the week of April the 1st, 2021. I went to five different stores in Dallas. The stores I went to will be listed in the description box for those of you who live nearby. So I went over into apparel and accessories and I found some new sun hats this week. They had them in the solid colors. They had solid black with the black ribbon, the tan with the tan ribbon and also white which was sold out already they had some faux leather bags and some cosmetic bags that say dream this one says love and one says beautiful and they have different floral backgrounds with a faux wicker bottom it's just printed on the outside also some new tote bags for shopping they had two different boba fett bags also one that had wonder woman they had the disney frozen the lol dolls Mickey Mouse with his friends. They also had one that was Jurassic World, Paw Patrol, and the Minions. Also, they had some reusable cloth tote bags. They get these in from time to time with different sayings on them. This time, they have the ones that say, make it happen, enjoy the little things, do your thing, and keep life simple. Also, they had some new eyeglass pouch bags. These are a cloth bag that have a drawstring at the top. They have a bunch of different patterns. One is like donuts. They have some summertime fruit. Also, the blue background with different polka dots. They have a rose floral print. One with panda bears on the front. Also, some different uh, wild animals and some solid colors. They also had some new Juncture brand socks. So these socks have like a 3D effect to all of them. This one has a 3D unicorn horn at the top that's covered in fuzz. This one has the 3D ears. They also have this one. It's got the 3D bow on the front. Then I found these new tank top t-shirts. These are a spandex and they um, only came in the extra small adult and they're by American Apparel. I also found some off-white and blue shirts by the Fruit of the Loom brand in the cotton and they were large and medium women's sizes. This week in Arts and Crafts, not a whole lot new, but they had the Momoko brand stickers. These are like those holographic stickers. You get nine in each pack. So when you like move the sticker, there's a different picture behind it. They had the dinosaurs, some ninjas. Uh, this one here is uh, some different sea life animals. They had like a hammerhead shark, things like that in the background. And then a bunch of these faux metal looking stickers that have a whole bunch of different sayings. You get anywhere from 8 to I believe 12 stickers per sheet. As you can see they have lots of like metallic kind of like outline. And a little bit of accent. And then there is like some really pretty watercolor almost like colors behind it. So I try to take pictures of all the different sheets that I can find. They did these hat. They did have these exact same stickers out about a year ago, and those are the Crafter Square brand for the Momoko brand. They had these extra large stickers. Um, there were four in all. So they had this large guitar, a rainbow, a donut, and a cat. And you'll see the last one, how big it is. I actually put an ink pen next to it to show you guys just how tall these stickers are. They're huge. Also, they have these color posters. It's a whole um, color poster set with markers. You get 14 posters in each box set. And I believe you get four markers. They had the Disney Princess, Mickey Mouse Jr., also the Disney Frozen, and Jurassic World. They had a lot of sheets of the um, chalkboard stickers. It says crop it stickers. You could cut them out and use them in all different shapes. Also, they had some gingham print ribbon. And this was in all of the um, Easter kind of like pastel colors. Then I found some tool that's folded up into these squares by Crafter Square. And you get um, a bunch of different pastel colors. There's three yards in each pack. And they also brought back the faux birchwood ribbon and the faux green leaf ribbon. Also, their domes are back in. And they had some new DIY signs that you could decorate. So they have this large circle that says home and 3D. Also one that says welcome. They have a boho rainbow. And then the last one in this set, there are four in a box, it says hello. And now we'll go over into the baby items. 
So this week they just had some cocoa butter um, conditioning Vaseline. They also had some baby powder scented Vaseline and then their car remote rattles that have the um, buttons that you push and it makes a beeping sound. Over in health and beauty, we'll start with the cosmetic items first. They had these um, boxes. Um, they're like a cosmetic box that you pop open. I really like them. They've got the tray inside with a mirror. They do come in pink, white, and blue. They also had these coffin-shaped nails. You do need to purchase the glue to go with these, but they all have some metallic accent pieces in them with the flat matte coloring as well. Then they had a whole bunch of the SGX NYC hair brand. They had some of the Beachy Wave textured spray, some new bonding spray to help keep your hair healthy, the Do It All, which is like a different kind of hairspray, and even some temporary foaming color. This will take your hair to like a midnight blue. And then they had some new barrettes out. So these have uh, material scrunched up on the front, the white with the black polka dots, or you could get it with the black material with the white polka dots on top. Also, these headbands, they had these out about a year ago. You can get them in the soft silvery blue color and tan. Um, the smaller scrunchies you get two, the extra large you get one, and then of course they've got the headbands to match. And then there were some butterfly bobby pins also in gold. For the pharmacy and personal care items, they have some new Epsom salt and lavender. Also some bath crystals in three different scents by Bolero. The regular uh, unscented Epsom salt and some bath salts. So this one is the rose and musk scent, clean cotton. This one is the Roman chamomile and lavender sandalwood. Also they had some new lotions. There are three different ones, Wonder, Crave, and Dream. And then the smaller ones for kids, they had grape, vanilla, grapefruit, watermelon, and vanilla. Some new hand and nail gloves to soften your hands. It says it's nourishing avocado. Then they had these wedding nail files. You get three in a pack. It says like bride to be and team bride. Over for fun finds this week, not a whole lot new. They just had some basket stuffers like these eye masks in the purple and the silver. They had some manicure sets in purple with flowers or the pink with the rainbows. Also some loofahs with the unicorn or I believe it's a fox. Also some uh, temporary tattoos. They have Spidey and Nickelodeon. It was Rugrats. And you get 25 uh, temporary tattoos in each pack. Now let's move over into home decor. They had these new votas, which were so pretty. It looks like this faux cracked glass. I believe they are like just a short vase. They had them in pink, a melon, kind of peachy color and white. They're super thick as you can see here. They're about a quarter of an inch thick. Really, really nice. Also these small jars in the amber color with the cork and the little metal tag. They had some new vases in, and then these new glass containers, which are really pretty. They have kind of like a iridescent uh, coloring on them. They're really, really pretty, as you can see here, and pretty tall as well, so they're a nice size container. Here's a view of the top. And then these vases they brought back in. So these are about 10 inches tall and they have that raised glass on the outside with that frosted look. And they had some more of those peach vases. If you guys haven't seen these rose colored vases yet, they're kind of like a rosy peach color. I hope you guys find them. They're super pretty. They had some new stretch canvas pictures also that had a more of like a farmhouse modern feel. I really love this set. I hope you guys get the set of the stretch canvas in because they have some really nice ones in. I love just the um, simplicity of the leaves. They had some with the succulents and different sizes and shapes and then just some different floral patterns. 
I just love the way this light gray and white one looks. It's so pretty, very soft. They had a two-tone blue one. Also, this photo, it has um, real soft peach, some gold in the corner, and then some gray. They had some different hanging baskets, and then a bunch of the eucalyptus leaves and the amber-colored vases. Some of them have sayings on them. I love this one with the three different vases. I think that was one of my favorites. They also had this one here with the wood palette look in the background, and a bunch of different animals with kind of like a mosaic look to them uh, or like an abstract kind of look the way they painted them really pretty also some hanging frames for cats and dogs it's a woof and meow and on the back as you can see they've got these little clips that you just um, move up and then you can take the backing off and add a four by four inch photo also, they had some new easel holders. Usually these are like the braided look. Now they just have them in the solid metal, which I really liked a lot. You can get them in black, gold, or silver, and they have them in two different sizes. They also brought back these um, photo or picture displays, kind of like a tabletop decor. Um, they only had two of them. Last year, they had a couple different ones. Um, so I don't know if they were sold out already and that's all that was left, but those are out again. Then I found these really cool um, tabletop photo frames. They have a different saying on the bottom of them. There's three different ones all on these little stands. And then the frame is raised up and you could just slide a photo down in the side and it holds a four by six inch picture. Over in Housewares Organization and Home Maintenance, they had some new um, night lights for kids. So the green one here, here's a view of it from the side. It's a frog. They also had a blue one, was a little kid dinosaur, and the pink one was a unicorn. And they have the on off switch on the side. They had a whole bunch of the Sylvania brand um, light bulbs. They had like LED bulbs. They had some halogen, some candelabra type ones for um, like chandeliers. They had uh, a few different bulbs that you could use in your refrigerator and your stove, indoor, outdoor. They had some halogen bulbs, um, a whole bunch of different ones. So I don't know why they had a whole bunch of them, but I know I saw them at every single store that I went to this week. Also, their new organizing compartments for the bathroom, they just restocked those and there's these two different versions that you could purchase. Over in Kitchen and Pantry this week, I just absolutely fell in love with their new kitchen decor. So they have this really pretty sage green color um, towels and then you could also get this gorgeous plate that says home sweet home this is the smaller salad plate they also have a dinner plate doesn't have writing on it but it does have the floral it matches with the blue or the sage green you can get them in the coffee cups they had salad bowls uh and then they had the smaller saucers as well, the monogram towels to match. And then in the floral print, they also had some bowls, some coffee mugs. And then again, the smaller plates have the home sweet home on it. The larger ones are just the solid plate with the floral. Also the um, different placemats. They had um, some coasters to match these jars they restocked and then some new magnets. These are some stretched canvas magnets, which I just absolutely love. They're really modern looking and I just think those are so cute. So those are on those little plastic strips that hang at the end of the aisle. They also had some new seasoning for gourmet burgers and chicken and some teriyaki marinade. I also found some new drink additive mix by Jelly Belly. Um, I think you get six in a pack. And then they also had some vegetable bouillon. Over in Office Supplies, Home Library, and Teaching Tree, they had these new journals that say Girls with Goals, the hardback journal. Also, this one that just says New Goals, has like a gold accent piece, Goal Get Em. This is some striped paper as well. Then they had a bunch of their uh, bulletin board items, like the little cutout pictures and things. They had a whole bunch of new ones out. Um, they just restocked them. Ours were looking pretty empty, so it was nice to see them finally get some new ones in. And they are actually new, a little bit more modern uh, with what's popular right now, like um, flamingos and things like that. They had this new alphabet game where you use a dry erase marker to write on the front of it. And then there's these little um, pictures like on discs that you can use to feed your monster and they just have to have the same beginning letter or sound which i thought was a really fun game to teach
Then at three of the stores I went to this week, they had a whole bunch of these new one inch binders and a whole bunch of different colors over in party supplies. Not a whole lot new there this week, but they did have these hundred count piece balloon clips to use with your balloon displays. Also, they had um, some new napkins for the springtime items with the roses on the side, some um, shot glass necklaces and some rainbow colors. And now we'll go to seasonal for seasonal items they had these small rugs that say happy easter the little blue truck with the easter eggs in the back they have the chick with the easter bunny and then the last one they had was this blue one that says happy easter they also had some basket filling things restocked like the small notebooks pens pencils also some um carrot garland it's already on the twine six feet long some new signs which I just love these little bunnies hanging on the front of them. I thought that was so cute. Um, and like I said, there's three different versions of this sign. They had a bunch of their window clings in. I found, I believe, three or four different sheets of the window clings. Those are fun to use in crafting. And I tried to get them as close as I could. They had them hanging really high, so it was hard to get a close-up picture of them. Now, these signs here for the garden, they're still in the box. I just took a picture of the sign on the side. They have like those little stickers on the side, so it's not real clear, but I did my best to get a picture of them. They also had these signs out for the garden. Um, these were just a sign that you could use in different plants and things like that. There, I believe there was um, six in all. They had six different colors or six different sayings. Also, the garden signs here, um, there's three different ones. They had those out about a month or so ago. Then they brought back these planners, which I just love, the hexagon planners in the black and the white. Um, the white one has either the yellow or the gray trim, and the black one has the white trim. A bunch of new planters with different designs, a bunch of different styles. And then um, the seeds were pretty much picked over, but they had just restocked them. And you get four for a dollar, which I think is a really good buy. They also had a bunch of their patriotic items out um, for like party supplies. They had paper straws, some wands, headbands, scarves, um, and some paper plates and napkins. Then they had some yard decor and the extra large pinwheels for the yard. Also, they had the um, regular size ball mason jars with the wick. You have to add the oil to them. Those were $1.25. They have the larger sizes for $3 in the plus section. They had some solar steak lights that look like palm trees and these really nice larger ones that look almost like a mason jar. You can get them in two different color uh, tops. They have the silver and the black toppers. Then in the Dollar Tree Plus section, which will be the three to five dollar items for three dollars, they had some smaller round pillows. And then for five dollars, you can get some larger ones. They had them in like a cream color, peach, gray, red and black. Also, these extra large um, flower pots for five. And then here are the $3 citronella oil jars. They're a little bit larger, more like a quart sized jar. They had these really cute food slice, um, play food with the knife and they Velcro together. There were two packs of those and they look like they come in these little uh, crates, some dream castles with the miniature dolls to go with them. There was a house and a um, castle. They had some Barbies that have the career. So one was a doctor. They have one that wanted to be like a DJ, a preschool teacher. And they come with the little um, Barbie with it, a bunch of different accessories. Also, they had some new stainless steel mixing bowls. And that is it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed this video, Please remember to come back on Friday so you won't miss what's new each week at the Dollar Tree. And of course, we do um, DIY craft videos every single Thursday. And I try to use mainly items that I find at the Dollar Tree. So this is what we made last week. If you guys would like to check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. Have a great weekend, everyone, and I'll see you next time.